Hey guys, welcome back to another brand new video. Now in this one, we're going to talk about two different projects. First one is the internet computer, um, which have their own native token called ICP, which is a very solid project. And uh, right now it is trading at $3.5, but there's speculation that it will reach above $100 in this coming bull run. So we're going to talk about the, you know, the project internet computer, what it is, we're going to take a look at the token on the coin market cap um, and we're going to see if it is possible that it will reach uh, $100. And another project that we have is called Socrates, which is an app. Uh, it is on the Polygon network, which allows us to ask questions and provide answers to questions. And while we're doing this, we get rewarded. So you get rewarded for asking questions and you get rewarded for answering questions. It is that simple and it is that interesting. So make sure that you watch till the end to find all about you know, both of these projects. If you're confused about something, of course, you can ask me in the comment section. I'll give you guys all the links, I'll be in the description. And uh, as always, anything that I'm gonna say in this video is not going to be an investment or a financial advice. So always do your own investigation research. And with this out of the way, let's get right into it. Now, first of all, don't take this as an ordinary project because it does some really great work um, and it has uh, a great future. And we're going to see how and why. The internet computer, this project, it was created uh, by ICP, which is one of the most uh, advanced networking protocol uh, that is ever designed. Uh, you can take a look at this link that we have right here. Uh, it will provide more information uh, on the ISP and so forth. Now, it allows people to build um, Web3 services and enterprise systems uh, directly on the public decentralized network. This can even scale uh, to host social networks and media streaming. Um, hosted services are tamper-proof, um, so you do not need firewalls. Um, you, it supports Web3 functionality uh, and can interact reliably with the outside world. Uh, also, this project has some pretty cool stuff, um, like we have Web3 um, identity, or you can say internet identity, uh, that basically enables users to um, consistently identify themselves quickly and securely with online systems uh, and services you know, using their devices. Um, for example, we have our laptop's uh, fingerprint uh, sensor or face ID on our uh, phone. And underneath this framework, uh, we have a modern hardware that keeps the keys and their you know execution uh, secure, uh, TPM chips in one. The entire code of the web browser is resistant to the web authn uh, protocol uh, of these TPMs and the advanced chain uh, key chipper running uh, on the internet computer network. There's so much more that you can check out uh, on their on their website. We have abundance of of information here. Um, so the topic um, of today's video is, is not really about you know all these things, all these complicated things. Uh, it is about you know their their native token, which is the internet uh, computer token, ICP token, which you can see on the coin market cap. If you take a look at the price, um, it is trading at about three point five six dollars with a four point two five uh, four percent uh, increase in in one day. Um, the twenty four hour daily volume is also really high, as you can see. Now this is one of the tokens whose price is, is poised to be above one hundred dollars. Not sure when that when that is going to happen because we are still not sure when the next bull run is going to arrive. But whenever I do, this is the token that is going to explode. That is going to you know um, go above one hundred dollars at least. Like that is the minimum. Now the project is doing great things. Um, you know, it is definitely one of the most solid projects. So if you're looking for for projects that are not you know risky, that are safe. I think this is one of the best ones that you can find. Now, of course, I'm not giving a financial advice. You can let me know if you think it is going to go above $100 or not. Either way, you know, it, it's an opinion. So don't take, you know, don't take this as an investment or financial advice. Now, let's talk about another great project that is called Socrates. Now, this is a very interesting project because, like I said in the introduction, in this, what we get to do is we get to ask question and we get to answer questions and while we're doing this we can get rewarded it's pretty simple um the first thing that you will need is is a 
invitational link in order to sign up, which I'm going to provide to you guys in the description. So make sure that you go over there, click on it. You'll come to this website. Uh, you can um, simply register using your uh, wallet. Uh, so make sure that you have the Polygon Matic Network selected in it. This is how I basically created my account. Then you can put your name in it. Now, once that is done, um, this is what you're going to see. This is the homepage that we have. Uh, we do have other links. Now, what we need in this one in order for us to start is in order to ask questions and in order to write answers and get rewarded, we need a pen. We need to mint a pen, which we get the option right here. So there's different levels of the pen and we can upgrade it. The more, you know, upgraded it is, the more level that it has, the more, you know, um, rewards we get. We're going to talk about the statistics and other information on the, you know, what determines the, uh, you know, the rewards that we get in this. But the first thing is we need to mint a pen. So right now I have no pen. Um, so we have level one pen, level two pen, and level three pen. Um, I'm going to go with the level one pen because we're starting out. Uh, you can, of course, choose the level one or level two, level three, whichever the one that you want. Um, of course, if you go for level three and you ask questions, you write answers, you win, you get rewarded. Of course, you're going to have you're going to win big and eventually it is going to pay off. So it's not really, really different. I'm going to go with the level one pen in the start. I'm going to click on submit. And it may ask me on the yes, of course, uh, it is going to ask you on your wallet. Um, I'm going to click on next. I'm going to click on approve. So it's less than 30 seconds. So let's see if it is indeed um, less than 30 seconds. I'm going to click on confirm. So we just have to pay for gas fees in Medic. Make sure that you have some Medic so you can pay for it. And there we go. So I do have the pen now. So in my assets, it says level one. Now these are the points which are necessary for us to have so i'll click on buy and it says well, let's see we have the option to get points or um actually i have two usdt i'm gonna go, just go with two usdt and see how many points do we get again it is going to ask me on the metamask click on sign in And we're going to pay for the gas fees again. So make sure that you have Matic. It says it will take a while to purchase points and you can continue after the purchase is successful. So please wait. Okay. So meanwhile, we're going to take a look at the beginners class one to learn how we can, you know, play, how we earn rewards. Okay. So the transaction is completed. Um, it says, please go to the wallet page to check the balance. Okay. So here we have this sheet, basically. Uh, through which we can learn how does the rewards work. So we have two types of reward. Uh, it says there's two types of, uh, of answer rewards for the discussion price. An individual can only receive one type of reward when answering a question. Then we have the criteria eligibility for rewards and so forth. And they explain how, you know, what the prize amount is going to be, which is going to be the, you know, the whole uh, prize pool that we have for a question. Um, you know, the total amount, it says multiplied by 20 divided by the number of, you know, total votes uh, that we have for that particular answer. Basically, how it works is you have a question you can see right here and uh, you get the option whether you want to go for A or B. And then you see the voting points that we have. So in this one, they're basically asking against, uh, you know, uh, if we have Naruto versus Luffy, who will win? So you can either choose Naruto or Luffy. Right now, there's more votes on, on Luffy than Naruto. And the voting points that we have is 0 0.5. That basically means if you want to provide an answer, it is going to cost a 0 0.5. In some cases, it is even 10 points, which is going to be worth 10 USDT, for instance. In this one, who is going to win? Godzilla versus King Kong, and the voting points is 10. So if I need to, if I want to answer it, I need to have 10 points. Currently, I, need, I only have two. So I'm not going to go for that one. I'll just vote for this one. So in this case, um, let's say I, wanna, uh, I vote for Naruto and it, it's going to cost me 0 0.5. I'll click on submit and it says vote successful. 
Now, depending on which one is the right answer, if, for example, the one I voted for is the correct answer, I am going to be rewarded using this formula that we have right here. And we have a reward coefficient. That means, which I already have explained, is the level of the pen. If you have a higher level in the pen, you are going to get more rewards. Um, and this is basically how this works. Then we have another type, which is after choosing an answer, a user is ranked after the 20th place among the participants who answered the question. Then we have the eligibility for rewards and reward coefficient and so forth. Um, but as I said in the start, um, we can only be in one type of reward at a time. So in this case, you get to answer a question. And if you're right, and if you have a higher level uh, of pen, depending, you know, it depends on what level do you have, you are rewarded. You also get to ask a question. So you can click on ask a question. You can write right here. For instance, I'm going to ask a question. That is, what will be the price of Bitcoin in the next, I can either say in the next, and days or, you, or I can choose the calendar and, and and choose the date for instance right now for me it is 25 October and I'll say um, what the price is going to be by 31st by the end of the, this month so let's say what will the price of Bitcoin be um, by the end of October in the option A I'll say less than 30k in an option B I'll say more than 30k now the reason I'm saying at, by the end of this month is the maximum validity that we have is of 10 days so I'll choose 10 click on submit in the channel make sure that you select the right category in this one it is going to be work and money and I'll say anyone can vote uh, I can add a picture I can tag users i can add a link um not sure what this is but the uh, in this one it says inject points so it says injecting points into your question can increase attention the injected points will go into the prize pool and will not be returned click on confirm and once you're satisfied you will click on create and when the question is posted people are you know people start uh, putting their votes there will be more and more in the prize pool and it can become trending and that is, you know, that is what happens. So you get rewarded by asking question and also by answering question. It is that simple. So this is a very interesting project. Make sure to check this out. Uh, I'll give you guys all the links. I'll be in the description. And yeah, uh, this is all of you guys in this video. And I'll see you guys in the next one shortly. So stay tuned.